This morning I placed 200 grams of dried black beans or one cup of dried black beans in this Tupperware. Added four bay leaves and four cups of water and they have been sitting for at least eight hours soaking. Now I'm going to coat the inside of the Instant Pot with extra virgin olive oil. This is the first step anytime I'm using the Instant Pot to prevent burning and make cleanup easier. I always add the wet ingredients before the dry ingredients and I don't stir the dry ingredients into the wet ingredients. That will also lead to less risk of burning. I've prepared two cups of beef bone broth using two packets of low sodium beef bone broth and two cups of water. I'm going to add the beef bone broth to the Instant Pot. Next, I'm gonna transfer the beans into a colander and rinse over the sink. I've rinsed the beans under tap water. Now I'm gonna transfer them to the Instant Pot. Add four tablespoons of garlic powder. Add four tablespoons of a dried herb. I'm gonna use basil this time. Add one teaspoon of ground pepper. I'm gonna approximate one teaspoon. Now, as tempting as it is to stir this, I'm not going to. That will prevent burning. I'm going to add the lid. Select pressure cook. Select pressure level, it should say high. Set the time for 12 minutes and it will start and stop automatically. All right, the Instant Pot is done cooking and it's depressurized. I'm gonna remove the lid. It's got a little too much liquid there. Next time, let me just taste how tender it is. It's also a little too chewy. Next time I'm gonna do it for, cook it for 14 minutes. Same amount of water. I'm now gonna saute the rest of the liquid off. And then when it's absorbed some more of the water and it's a better consistency, I will transfer it to a Tupperware. This will be four servings of beans that I'll have uh, over salad for the next four days. I've sauteed it for an additional 10 minutes so that I could reduce the liquid. This is a pretty good consistency now. I'm gonna transfer this to a Tupperware and this will be uh, beans for the next four days.